Cincinnati sophomore Morley Hill leads the young Bearcats in scoring, cashing in over 13 per game. Her club invades Al territory, and at the forefront is Temple's Tiana Williams, a three-point threat who is the lone senior for the Cherry and White. And with that, we welcome you to the American Conference on ESPN. We're nestled inside one of Philly's cherished basketball arenas, McGonagall Hall, where the Temple Owls host the Cincinnati Bearcats. Great to have you with us this evening with former Virginia standout Chelsea Shine. I'm Dave Leno. Both these teams duked it out 17 days ago with Temple victorious by 17. In fact, Cincinnati relinquished 33 Temple field goals in that match, the most they've given up all year. What are your big takeaways from that game? Well, a few weeks ago when these two teams matched up, Cincinnati gave up some early baskets, which led to Temple's offense in transition. And then in the second half, Temple able to shoot over 58%. Erica Coville, 9 for 9 from the field. Cincinnati's going to have to find an answer for her tonight. Both these teams have experienced growing pains largely due to one senior playing on both ends of the floor, but they have some freshmen playing like upperclassmen in Anna Owens and Aaliyah Butts. Well, Anna Owens and Aaliyah Butts are the bread and butter for this team as the point guard, and just as freshmen, Anna Owens first in the conference in minutes played, leading the league in freshman scoring, and then Aaliyah Butts, who they call squirt, is all over the court, court at 5-4. It's the ninth straight game. The Cincinnati coaching staff has opted for this starting five. Chelsea Jamison is the lone senior who sees time, and Marley Hill has punched in seven double-doubles in the last ten games. Meanwhile, for the Temple Owls, Aaliyah Butts makes her eighth consecutive start. In place of Fionda Fitzgerald, who's coming off the bench as the sixth man, Mama Treor is making her third straight start, and Erica Coville has posted back-to-back double-doubles. Leading the Bearcats is Jamel Elliott. In the midst of her sixth season, the team started out at a pedestrian 1-8, but have since gone 4-4 four four in the last eight games. And on the opposite bench is Tanya Cardoza. In her seventh year at the Temple Helm, started conference play 3-0 for the first time since the 2010-11 season. Since then, 1-2 with losses to USF and UConn. 